Well, looky there. Everybody should get a chance to tell you the weather now and then. At least once. <laughs> anyway. And uh, since our weather person didn't make it to the end of time today, I'm going to Let's take a look at what it was. Now, is that right now, right? It's 50 degrees, and that isn't bad. 34% humidity. And... <laughs> 29.79, the wind northeast at 10 miles an hour. Not bad at all. Let's take a look at the national map. Let's see. If I pull this out right here, I should tell you that there's thunderstorms over in the Ohio Valley. It's still winter up here where you see partly cloudy. It's cold up there. It's kind of warm and humid down here. McAllen, Texas, is high at 91 degrees and somewhere up in New York. Glen Falls, New York, 9 degrees was the low. That's the way it is across the nation. Let's take a look at our part of the state. Now, there is a low system way down here that's uh, between uh, the coast. Can you see that? You can't see down there. It's down there, and uh, it, it's between uh, Oregon and California, kind of off the coast, and it's working counterclockwise, and that's supposed to be pumping moisture into our area, but it isn't coming in here. So it's pretty clear, and it got clear down into the 20s last night uh, in eastern Washington in some parts of it. The only moisture we can expect in the state may be way over here in the southeastern corner, so watch for that. The rest of us, it's going to stay clear and get kind of nice. So, we'll watch for that. Let's take a look at the, uh, oh, well, we were going to take a look. There goes that map, here goes this map. Now, let's take a look. There it is. Huh, okay. <laughs> this place is booby trap. I just tripped. <laughs> you can see there's not much out there. Let's, Let's go on to our figures real quick here. Uh, where do you want me to stand? Down this way. Uh, it got up all the way to 51 degrees today in Yakima. The highest ever was 76, and the lowest ever was 23. Let's take a look at the mountains. Uh, mostly fair through Wednesday, and that's good news. In eastern Washington, uh, expect, uh, oh, western Washington's cool night. 